Hi boys and girls, Miss Mary here to bring you this week's lesson. And this week's lesson is really kind of interesting. I even brought a backpack with me for today because you know what? We're talking about going on a trip. When you go on a trip, what do you do? You have to pack your bag, don't you? Well, let's see. See what I've got in my bag here today for us. Oh, nothing in there. Let me see. I could be in serious trouble. Oh, look what I brought. A mask. Yep, these days when you go someplace, you need a mask. I brought a toothbrush. Toothbrushes are really good. Good thing I brought toothpaste to go along with it, too. Yep, 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 yep. Let's see. Oh, in here's, oh, here's a shirt and some shorts. Oh, that's always good. And a pair of socks. Well, you get the idea, don't you? There's a lot of things in my backpack that I was packing to go on my trip with me. And I bet anything when you pack to go on a trip, you pack all the important things that you need too. But you know what our lesson is about today? Our lesson is in the book of Mark, Mark chapter 6. And it talks about Jesus, who is our friend. And Jesus is sending out the disciples. Remember the disciples were the people that followed Jesus? Yep, they were. Well, he was getting ready to send them out so they could teach people and they could do all kinds of things. And he told them in their story, in the story today, in the Bible story today, exactly what to do. So boys and girls, I have some pictures as I share this story with you, okay? Jesus called the 12 and began to send them out two by two. He gave them authority over the unclean spirits. He instructed them to take nothing for the journey but a staff, no bread, no bag, no money in their belts, and to put on sandals, but not to wear two tunics. Jesus said to them, Whenever you enter a town, stay there until you leave the area. If a place will not welcome you or listen to you as you go out from there, shake the dust off your feet as a testimony against them. So they went out and preached all should repent. They cast out many demons. And they anointed many sick people with oil and healed them. Boys and girls, this is a great lesson today. It really is. Because you know what it tells us? It tells us that Jesus gave the authority and the power. And he had already taught the disciples what to do and how to do it. And so he was sending them out to continue to do the work that he knew he could no longer do. And boys and girls, you know what? He does that today for us too. He tells us that we need to be sent out. Now they were told not to take any money or no extra clothes. How could they possibly go on a trip like that? You know what? They trusted Jesus and Jesus knew that they would be taken care of. And you know what? Jesus knows that today, too, about us, boys and girls, as we're sent out. Like I'm being sent out to help teach you when we have our classes, whether they're online or whether we're in church. God knows. And the Bible tells us that the disciples went out telling people everywhere about how good God is and to repent and to have Jesus come and live in their hearts. They did exactly what Jesus told them to do because Jesus gave them the power to do so. And Jesus told you and me to go and make disciples. So as we teach other people and tell other people about Jesus, we are being disciples of Jesus too. Do you think you're ready to go? Remember last week we talked about telling other people about Jesus? Did you remember to tell somebody about? Did you? I hope so. I did. 
I talked to my next door neighbor and you know what? I'm going to talk to her again this week because I see her a lot. So God gave us the ability to share the good news. And boys and girls, I hope that you do that. Every day, every week, I hope you tell somebody about the good news of Jesus. Let me pray for you right now. Father, we know that many people need to hear the good news about Jesus. And Jesus told us to go and to make disciples. Help us to be willing to go. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Hey, and boys and girls, I know we're meeting together in church here occasionally, and Miss Mary has a handout sheet for you if you happen to be at service. But if you don't, you can always go to our church website, and all of the handouts that go along with today's lesson will be there for you. So, boys and girls, I hope you take advantage of that. And until we get a chance to meet again, Miss Mary misses you. Bye!